welcome to this episode of our podcast, The Our Common Champion Speaks, with yours sincerely, Bishop Julius Abiola, the presiding Bishop of Christ Life Ministries, located at 1694 14th Street. Today I want us to go through the scriptures and we'll go specifically to the first epistle of Paul to the Corinthians chapter 16. Today we are concentrating on service. The Bible says that we should serve the Lord with gladness. And this is what is missing in many lives and in many quarters in the church today. Paul made reference to a family in the 15th verse. And he said, I beseech you, brethren, you know the house of Stephanas, that it is the first fruit of Achaia, and they are addicted themselves to the ministry of the saints. What a commendation. They have addicted themselves to the ministry of the saints. Now, this was the first fruit, more or less, the first set of Christians in Greece. The word Achaias there means Greece. And these were men, uh, a, fa- a family of a man called Stephanas. He said they have addicted themselves to the ministry of the saints. That is what is missing in many lives today. Their devotion was commended. And when you look at that scripture, it is easier to understand in the version the New Living Translation. It says, you know the, the Stephanus and his household were the first of the harvest of believers in Greece, and that they are spending their lives in service to God's people their devotion, serving God's people. Now, when we talk about service, what do we mean? In the world, people are rewarded by titles. But in the house of God, it's not like that in ministry. Jesus Christ even said the other day that the mother of seven his children came to Jesus. And he knelt down before Jesus, worshiping him. Jesus said, what do you want? And he said that this is my son, two out of twelve, must sit one at your right hand and the other one at your left hand. Jesus said, if they are ready to drink of the cup that I will drink, for me, it's not for me to tell them, to tell them who is going to sit by my right hand or my left hand, but whosoever my father gives it to. And the Bible says, all of his son, all the other disciples, 10 of them, began to murmur. They were full of indignation. They were very, very furious, and Jesus Christ needed to calm them down. That in the world, those who are in authority in the world, they lord it over the people, but it shall not be so amongst you. It shall not be so amongst you. We need, as a church, to do reorientation for ministry. Ministry is not, uh, it's not the way people have taken it today. Everyone wants to make money out of it. Everyone wants to build an empire out of ministry. It is not like that. When Jesus Christ returns, when we are all done and gone, will our children be able to say, faith of our fathers, only faith, we will be with you. We will be true to you till your death. That is my prayer, as we encourage you to serve the Lord and be committed to the ministry of the saints. This week, we want to invite you to one of our services. On Wednesday, we meet at 7.30 at the church, on Friday, 7.30 p.m. at the church for what we call Possibility Hour, and on Sunday, 10 a.m. in this place, 1694 Street. That is the Cathedral of the Hong Kong Champions in Brooklyn, New York. God bless you. 
be on top of the world with all things under your feet and be strong in the Lord. God bless you.